Hello, my name is Charles Wilson, and I was first introduced to JetMatch while enrolled in the Boston University Online Genealogical Certificate Program, learning how to solve an unknown parent case. I had no clue back then what I was doing in that course when first introduced to JetMatch. Today, I have been able to achieve a whole lot more since using JetMatch in that first course. I later became project administrator for two JetMatch ancestor projects, one being the African-American Griot Legacy Project, and the other is the African Diaspora DNA Collaboration Project, which currently have 543 JetMatch members who submitted over a total of 1,010 DNA kit numbers to these two projects. The project members are coordinating and collaborating our ancestry connections to the 16th through the 19th century transatlantic slave trade. I, I really think JetMatch is cutting edge for now and the future of genetic and family DNA ancestry research. To sign up is free. There are free tools within JetMatch that once you become familiar, it enhances your family ancestry and genealogical search. And for me, each time I learn a little bit more about science in the area of biology using the tools in JetMatch. Hi, my name is Darcy. I had an Ancestry account and one morning I went on to see if I had any new matches and there was a very close match and I managed my brother and my sister's accounts. So when I checked their um, relationship with this person, they each said half brother or half sister. Mine said first cousin. So I got a hold of her and we chatted and we put our DNA on JetMatch so we could check the X chromosome because we knew that it was my dad. And sure enough, we are half sisters and she's wonderful and I love her and I'm so glad I found her. Um, I recommend it to anybody um, who wants to double check their DNA matches. Um, it's been great. I highly recommend it. I joined JetMatch to assist me in challenge I was having in finding information on my great grandmother on my maternal side. She'd come to Australia in the late 1890s and throughout her life here and all her documentation in Australia, she showed her parents as people living in Birmingham and that she had been brought up in a poorhouse. I couldn't find any further information on her parents' parents or any general information through census details. JetMatch, however, showed me a maternal match with a young woman in England. This young woman's great-great-grandfather has turned out to be my great-grandmother's real father. This has been confirmed now through other matches on JedMatch and those in her family tree and some that I had that I wasn't too sure who they were. JedMatch is a fantastic tool and I fully recommend anybody that's got a challenge in trying to find out who somebody is in their life, try JedMatch. Thank you.